So moving forward, number eight. Again, coordination, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. The hands don't change. All that changes is the foot. Uh, so making these exercises more adaptable to different playing styles, you can play with different rhythms. So you could play with quarter notes. That's the exact same beat with quarter notes on the hi-hat. This time I'm going to play the same beat with 16th notes on the hi-hat. Depending on your director or your teacher, he will have you play right, left, right, left, or all with the right hand. This is where accenting the, the hi-hat can really help you move the groove forward. You can also play these same rhythms and same grooves on the ride cymbal. On the bell. Bell and rod. You could also put the hi-hat on the downbeats to add another level of coordination. Etc. Et the patterns never end. You can always make them more difficult.